The culture of Holland and Knight, I think, was was there from the beginning. When we joined the firm in our negotiations, uh, someone said to, to me that you're more like us than we are. Dick Duvall and Holland and Knight are models of outstanding volunteer service in the region. They have had a profound impact on the organizations that they've been engaged with. No one works harder. Uh, than Dick Duvall to try to get the right answer. He's typically the first one in the office and the last one to leave. Uh, he's tireless in his devotion to Holland and Knight, uh, to the clients that we represent, and to our community out here in Tyson's. What makes Dick a good connector is he knows everybody. He's got probably the best Rolodex of anyone I know. Uh, you know, you can be saying, gee, I'd really need to find this person, and he'll just go in there and uh, find the person in his contact somewhere. It's, it's just amazing how he can connect people. I think I admire his integrity. Um, he's loyal, he's hardworking, and he's just got an impeccable character. And that integrity just comes through in everything he does, professionally and personally. Well, Dick's leadership in Northern Virginia really is the inception of the Northern Virginia office. Dick said to the firm, Northern Virginia is where so much of the clients are, where the business community is going, and Holland and Knight needs to be there. When we came out to Northern Virginia, uh, our focus was to build our reputation, build our brand, but also to live the values of the firm in terms of uh, dedication to public service activities. And that value within the organization of community service uh, has been extremely important. It's been a differentiating factor, I think, between Holland and Knight and many other law firms. What he said was the Community Foundation should never focus on the size of its donor-advised fund charitable assets. Rather, it should focus on getting as much of those back out into the community as possible. And he articulated that vision beautifully. He um, created a, a very coherent and compelling argument behind it. He galvanized the board of directors behind it. And as such, he really changed the way the Community Foundation thought about its work. On behalf of CPS, I'd like to do a shout out to Dick Duvall and Holland and Knight. Thank you for all your great work you've done in the community, especially your involvement with Easter Seals, serving DC, Maryland, and Virginia, and helping so many with disabilities and our military veterans and their families. What Dick Duval and Holland and Knight have meant to the American Red Cross and the National Capital Region is, is real partnership in saving lives and bringing help and hope to literally thousands of people in our community. You know, Dick and every one of the Holland and Knight members, my team and I have worked with, really care about this community. They get involved, they get engaged, they get other people involved, and they really make a big difference with their leadership and their actions. Dick Duvall is a legend with the Fairfax County Chamber of Commerce. He's a former chairman of the Fairfax Chamber and is still involved to this day as a board member. But more than that, he's a go-to person when you need the hard advice and is really a champion for Fairfax County. Dick Duvall is a special human being, Holland and I, a great team of community builders and leaders in Northern Virginia. Congratulations, the Community Leadership Award to Dick Duvall, my friend, and Holland and Knight, a wonderful offering. Well done.